This video will guide you to connect Linux VPS with CMD form Windows Server and introduce you some foundational commands to manage your files or folders on Linux Server. Connect to your own server. Connect to your server with this command. Now you can work with your Linux Server. In the next two minutes, we will introduce you some of the most basic Linux commands. Let's start with the simplest ones. View the current directory. If you want to know where you are, use pwd command to view current directory. Show directory contents. This command helps you check the files and subdirectories in the current directory. Enter the directory. Then you can enter the directory you need with this simple command. Return. If you want to go back to the previous directory, tap this command directly. If you want to return to home, just tap cd and enter. Create folders. You can create a folder with this command. For example, I am creating a test folder. And as we can see, it was created easily. Delete directory. Now I want to delete the test file that I just created. I will use the rmdir command. Let's check that the test folder has been deleted. Copy files or folders. You can use these three commands to meet your different copying needs. Here we will demonstrate copying the cat folder under desktop to documents directory. Let's first go into the desktop directory and check that there is a cat folder here. I will go into the cat folder to see what's in it. Now let's go back to home and use the command to copy the cat folder. Next we will a cd and ls command to check if the copy was successful. And here we can see that the copy was well done. Move files or folders. The way to move files or folders is similar to the copy method. We just need to change the cp command to mv command. Here we will demonstrate how to move and keep the folder with the same name. Now I want to move the cat folder from the desktop directory to the documents directory. Enter the command. Let's go into the documents directory and see if the move was successful. Here it shows two cat folders, which means we have moved successfully and kept the folder with the same name. Delete a file or folder. Now let's try to delete the folder we just moved in. Enter the delete command. When we check the directory again, we see that the cat folder has been deleted. Create a file and enter the editor. You can use this command to create the file. For example, if we go to the desktop directory and create a file name test2, by reviewing, we see that the file was successfully created. Now I want to go into the editor and edit the test2 file. Use the vim command. When you want to exit and save, type zq. If you want to learn more basic Linux commands, Please follow our channel and look forward to the next video. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to leave a comment under the video and discuss with us.